Greetings, beloved, beautiful beings. This is a transmission that I would like to offer forth to humanity at this really crucial time in our evolution. As we are all embarking on the most powerful, soul-transforming, energetically expanding journey right now, we are being confronted with the deepest, darkest of what the universe has to offer. And by the universe, I mean every single different energy realm does not compare in its low density to what we are experiencing on planet Earth. Meaning, those of us who are here now are the universe's most gifted light workers, alchemists, energetically sensitive, intuitive, empathic beings, because this really is as real as it gets. On planet Earth, on a daily basis, each of us experiences everything the universe has to offer, whether that be the low of the low or the high of the high. And ironically, I find that this polarity and this push and pulling where we have people whose belief systems are absolutely constrict and fit and form and only focused in the lowest of the low, the anger, the hatred, the resentment, the rejection, while at the same time, even in the same space, be it a bus, be it a conference room, be it a work environment, an office space, could that person could also be vibrating in the highest light and the highest love for themselves and others, taking and seeing that darkness and density and loving it to completion, to wholeness, back to the light. And the light and the dark is pulling so intensely everywhere we are that out of this intense pull, pulling apart and tearing apart is a new dimension, a whole new universe, truly where the consciousness that we are all embodying in form, which is our thoughts, our emotions, our experience, our body itself, its cellular memory that is all consciousness, and we are pure consciousness, that is expanding into new form, into new areas of awareness that nowhere in the universe has this ever happened before. These words may sound grandiose, Broad sweeping, but truly, there are many third dimension planets, third dimensional planets in our galaxy, trillions perhaps in our universe. Yet, out of all those experiences, we have all chosen to come here to Earth, to Gaia, in billions of unique vibrations and form for the very reason that this is the cutting edge of consciousness. We have the opportunity to do here, collectively and individually, what has never been done before. And that is why this new frontier in every moment, in every breath, in every experience is so vital and important. We may feel that we are overcomplicating things and we are reading too much into what we're experiencing or just going too deep, and that's bullshit. Truly, every bit of that matters because our experience is that meaningful, is that profound, is that complicated and confusing, angering yet totally triumphant, integrated yet disconnected, and all of these words and vibrations that we make up in our own consciousness mean something. And here in physical form, we get to experience all of that vibrating tangibly. Whereas in other dimensions, in different parts of our, this universe and the many universes there are, it's lighter and more etheric. And what's beautiful about the third dimension is we could completely leave our minds and our consciousness in the past or the future and only focus there and completely be oblivious to the now, which is much harder to do in other dimensions. Yet in this one, we are given that opportunity to 
as it can possibly produce and does often produce the most profound concentration and focus in the now when we go from that state of disconnection in past and future to living in the present. It's almost like in order to ascend in these levels in the universe, there must be some sort of separation in between one point, point A, and point B. And that separation is what we experience in the third dimension and many other dimensions, but really from third to fourth and above, is kind of like the most monumental, profound, divine shift in our soul's experience as we return to spirit and as we ground the light of spirit into form, which is always fleeting, which is always passing, yet it can have the significance and the meaning and the total uh, integrated capacity of the entire universal cosmos. And that's what's beautiful about planet Earth. So for those who are feeling down, downtrodden, confused, alone, separated, rejected, disconnected, may it be the light of your highest evolution that is creating that experience for you to grow as you have never grown before. That is the message of the day. I love you.